एक्सपेरिमेंट नंबर ऑब्जेक्टिव स्टडी द करेक्टरिस्टिक ऑफ अ रिजेक्टर सर्किट एंड डिटरमिन द अननोन इंडक्टेंस ऑपरेटर्स रेजिस्टर कैपेसिटर इंडक्टर फ्रीक्वेंसी जनरेटर ऑसिलोस्कोप कनेक्टिंग वायर्स एंड एसी सप्लाई थ्योरी It is the opposite of acceptor circuit due to the component configuration. If an inductor and capacitor are connected in parallel and AC voltage is applied across them, then in this case it is the voltage rather than current which is the same on each element of the circuit. And current in this case is minimum at resonance because the current in capacitive branch is in opposite phase to the current in the inductive branch. Since the current is rejected by the parallel combination of lc at resonance hence it is termed as rejected circuit in this case impedance is maximum at the resonance procedure experimental setup of the rejected circuit the experimental setup of the rejected circuit is same as the acceptor circuit this one is the cathode oscilloscope frequency generator and the breadboard The components used in the ejector circuit are same as we had in acceptor circuit. Capacitor, inductor, and here it is. See, uh, it is capacitor, uh, resistor. The difference between uh, ejector circuit and acceptor circuit is their combination. In acceptor circuit, we had all of these components in series, while in ejector circuit, we have inductor and capacitor in parallel. and in series with both of them we have this resistor the behavior the behavior of acceptor circuit is totally opposite as of acceptor circuit here you can see we have applied frequency from here again the range is 1 kilohertz and as we increasing the frequency the amplitude of the amplitude starts decreasing and then at a particular point it starts increasing again the point at which we get the minimum amplitude is the resonant frequency point you have to take the uh, take the reading with five different like 10 kilohertz 15 kilohertz 20 kilohertz and so on the frequency is the independent parameter here because by changing the frequency the amplitude is changing and the amplitude is the independent okay so that's all about the procedure of ejector circuit i hope it will clear to all observations you will get a table like this the amplitude versus frequency where the capacitance of the capacitor is constant 0.001 microfarad graphs and calculations then you have to plot the graph between the frequencies and amplitude the graph will have a shape like this and you will find the resonant frequency which is the frequency with maximum amplitude and then you will substitute the value of frequency and capacitance in the formula to find the unknown inductance and the original form 1 upon f is equal to 1 upon 2 by under root lc and then you will rearrange the formula for the inductance and by putting the value of resonant frequency f and capacitance you can find the inductance and its unit will be in hindi thank you very much please subscribe like and share